Okay, well, well, today I'm making something really delicious. It's called a blueberry cobbler. It's a wonderful, wonderful summertime dish. You know, we have had a little cooler weather than normal for the summer, which, you know, it happens sometimes, folks. You never know with the weather. I'm going to add in two tablespoons of sugar. It's going into fresh blueberries. Try to add a little bit more in if you can, but this will work too, all right? I'm adding in three tablespoons of sugar. This is going to go into the blueberries. These are fresh blueberries. You could use frozen, but I really strongly recommend you use fresh. Okay. I'm a little low on blueberries because I've been making a lot of stuff with blueberries, but you know, it'll be fine. I'm going to spread this all over the place. What's all? It should be enough. Okay. Now, what I want to do now is I'm going to do uh, the topping. I'm planning on using two thirds cup of flour. Use a whole stick of butter. I'm going to use two thirds cup of flour. I'm going to cream this together. Today. Oh my goodness. My pool is done. My yeah, landscaper right. came by. We have a lot of property. You have to maintain it, folks. Two thirds cup of flour. Okay, I'm now adding in baking powder, which I almost forgot. Now that would have been horrible. One fourth teaspoon of baking powder. Oh, folks, I did a great show last night of virtual theater. I did Mamma Mia. Fun. I was in the ensemble. It was a lot of fun. I'm also adding in an egg. There we go. Big egg. Also adding in some vanilla. Folks, we have a vanilla shortage. Not here, but I tried to get vanilla yesterday at the store and I literally had trouble finding it. It's very sad because, you know, adding in about a half a teaspoon of vanilla. When you need something, when you have a cooking show and you can't find it, it's really hard. I'm going to add a little bit less. But it's such a shortage of vanilla right now. Even here we have a shortage. Here we go. Now, what I want to do now is I want to cream this together. Yeah, I'm dressed in blue. I miss blueberry. I want to do some things with blueberries. Now you can see what you want this dough to look like. Nice put together when you make a pie dough. Now, don't worry folks, we don't have enough. This is going to spread. It should spread all over the place. Put it on top of the blueberries. We have a little sort of blueberries, but you know, like there's a, here we go. Just put it all over your blueberries and it's going to become a blueberry cobbler. Folks, we had a little change. We were short on blueberries, so we're going to call this a berry, berry uh, cobbler. I added some blackberries in with the blueberries. You can mix your berries together. If you want short on some, you can always add in another kind of berry. They won't get along because many times I made even a berry, berry pie. So we're going to pop this in the oven and this should spread. Should be done in about an hour. And here we have a berry berry cobbler. We're gonna put a little whipped cream around a little bit of decoration here. Here we go. And here we have a delicious one for berry berry cobbler. It's made with blueberries and blackberries. You put a little whipped cream around it. For, it tastes really delicious. From Deborah Ray Tom Country Kitchen, have a great day. Please subscribe to our wonderful YouTube channel.